right, guys. Okay. So I think it's between this one and that one. That one. Definitely. You can't believe ice cream. It's great. Bill? No. I don't like that one. I do. Well, I sort of do, too. Only, damn, I need Lily. Mmm, give me some of that. What? <sighs> Eli? It's your own. I don't want my own. I want yours. <laughs> it should be that one. Mm. Definitely. Hello? Hey, Lil. Is anybody home? Oh, hi. Hi. Um, I just came by to pick up a... Uh, here it is. <laughs> Seventeen years ago, I bought Lily this book of baby names. And I said, I know you're not having a baby yet, but I just wanted you to... And she interrupts me, and she says... I am. I am having a baby. How did you know? Wow, there's a lot of names in here. I paid for that book. Uh, not that you shouldn't. I just meant. Actually, you know what I just remembered? Jake's buying me a, a Name the Baby book. I can't believe I forgot that. I'm so pregnant. <laughs> oh, congratulations. Lily said that they're, uh, they're turning book lovers into a chain. Oh, no, no. Some guy just... Pay me some money so we could use the name in a couple of stores, so now I can expand if I ever find the right space. You know what? It's too bad you can't run a, a bookstore out of a restaurant, because I know one you could get real cheap. <laughs> and then you could have Jake run it for you. But I mean, that's obviously not what you're going to do. <laughs> so where's Lily? Ms. Samler. By the end, I was involved in virtually every aspect of production. I mean, it was a great opportunity. Look, I'm going to be honest with you. Oh, no. I think you're great. And I, I know that we would click. The age thing or the dot-com thing? It's the you didn't finish college thing. Oh, that thing. And my boss, see, if you hadn't told me, I could just not tell him. But since you told me... It's so ridiculous. I only needed, like, ten credits. Truthfully, you should just say you graduated. Oh, no. No, you should. Everybody does. Okay, why are you telling the truth in a job interview? What were you, under oath? Because I can't lie. I'm a terrible liar. You're only 12 credits short. 16. You told me 12. Yeah. Let's see the resume. Elizabeth Sandler. I know I'm not used to it either. Well, some people keep their names. Oh, Rick, I'm keeping Jake's name. No, not Jake's name. Your name. Your real name. Okay. I ran into Tiffany the other day, and she said something. Wait, wait, what's my real name? Okay, I'm sorry. What did Tiffany say? Just something stupid. I gotta go. Judy, come on, I'm listening. That's great, but I'm late. For what? To meet Will Gluck? Well, you've seen him since the wedding, haven't you? Well, I assumed he'd call. He didn't. You should call him. Goodbye, Lily. Judy, don't go. What about the logos? Like, I can't make a decision without you. Well, I made it through your journals, for the most part. But enough about me. How did you feel about the experience? Oh, me? Or whoever's sitting in your chair. Well, I've kept journals before, so... Oh, you have? Yes, on and off. And what's that like? It's fine. It's nice. I'm, I'm sorry. I thought you said nice. I did say nice. I wouldn't want to misquote you or anything. I said nice. 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 <laughs> Let me see. Whatever shall I do today? I know. I shall write my boring old journal. It will be ever so nice. <laughs> uh, 
Nice is for shrimp salads and grandmothers. I'm not, I'm not interested in nice. Hi. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, you shouldn't have. Here. Oh, well, next time, you just have to let me pay you. I read one contract. I know next to nothing about licensing. Have you proclaimed your unworthiness enough? Can we open this thing? Show my ex-brother-in-law's restaurant where the guy shot himself. We had lunch there. Oh, right. <laughs> well, the bank is about to foreclose, mm -hmm. and I was thinking of taking over the mortgage and having book lovers be like a bookstore slash cafe. That's a wonderful idea. No, it isn't. I don't know anything about running a restaurant. So? Hire somebody who does. Hire your ex-brother-in-law. Hire Jake? Huh. You said he did a good job on the place, you know, before the... Yeah, but that would just be so awkward. Of course, it'll be really awkward when I don't hire him. Mm. So you don't think a bookstore restaurant is a dumb idea? I think it's a great idea. You're not just saying that because you're drunk? I'm completely sober when I'm drunk. <laughs> I hate my creative writing teacher. Oh, yeah? He, like, publicly humiliates me. Well, I do that, and you don't hate me. Yeah, I do. Well, yeah. Well, his name is August, which is That's so... That's not even a name. That's a month. Exactly. And you act like he's the only person in the whole world who knows anything. Well, isn't that how you act? Eli, shut up. Hey, hey, watch it. What are you going to do? I'll show you what I'm going to do. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Zoe, let's go. What? They obviously want to be alone. What? No, we don't. No, they don't. No, Jess. No, see. No, Jesse, we don't want to be alone. Wait. Zoe. Well, I have to write yeah, in my journal. Me too. I mean. No, I know. Right. Gosh, there's so many names. The other day at one of those interviews, somebody called that Elizabeth Samwer, and I thought, who's that? That's for a minute. Yeah, well, Elizabeth is kind of a weird name. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll be right up. <gasps> oh, jeez, you scared me. Tiffany lets herself in. You shouldn't leave your door unlocked if you don't want people to... Lily? I've got very exciting news. Oh, my God. You're getting married to Will Gluck. No. I'm saving Phil's. What? Well, I'm going to pay off the bank and move the bookstore into the restaurant and have a bookstore slash restaurant. Judy, that's a great idea. Mm -hmm. Did that just come to you out of the blue, or...? I... Well, the point is, you need a job, and I need a partner. Oh, Jude. So, will you do it with me? Come on. Judy, we have problems working together. Wait, what problems? I gave you this, you know. What problems? Yeah, so everybody has problems. That's no reason not to. Don't you watch VH1? I mean, if the Go-Go's can get back...